how do you reflect on that? Um, many a Scottish Premiership side couldn't come here and put quite as good a showing as your side did. Yeah, I mean, that, that's true, but ultimately, you know, I, I went over to the fans, but I would have went over far, far closer if we'd have won the game. Um, so ultimately, it's a cut tenure you're out. But, um, yeah, I was, I was very proud of our players and our supporters today. Um, but, you know, we, we're here to try and win a game of football, and we didn't do it. I thought the first half were terrific, and they, they executed everything we wanted them to do really well in terms of matching up rotations in midfield in terms of coming out with a back three to engage if you've only picking up one guy etc 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 and Al McGregor made two unbelievable saves the one from Turner what a save it was uh, and then one from Tiffany so I mean that was pivotal in the match maybe we could have been in 2-0 up would have given us more to hang on to Rangers were better in the second half made a couple of changes I think uh, Tillman who, who I'm sure we'll talk about um, he, he can play he really can play and you know our goalie had to make two or three saves. Overriding feeling is disappointment to lose the third goal from a from a just a bog standard set play. Young corner, it's a lesson for him. Who was magnificent. He was part of Scotland under twenty one squad. Uh, obviously didn't get tight enough. Um, he paid the penalty. Much of the focus will be on Rangers' second goal and then your second goal. Can yeah. you talk to us about your? From your point of view. Well, from my point of view, I thought um, Alec Tillman didn't really realise what was going on, uh, and I don't blame the referee because I'm not sure he can stop it. Maybe he can. I, I'm not sure of the rules and that, but I'm not sure he realised what was going on, and and he, and he scored the goal. And quite obviously, he should retreat. And just we were just about to kick it back to them, uh, and then Mick made a decision which I think reflects very well on him in this football club. Although Al McGregor, I thought at one point wasn't going to let him put it in the net, um, and then it was game on after that, two all. So I, I, I hold no ill feeling towards Malik Tillman whatsoever. I, I'm not sure he really realised the, 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 what he was doing. We're just real disappointed we, we lost the third goal. Not a situation that crops up very often. Well, I've been in football since 1981, and I've never seen it again before in any games I've been involved in. Do you think most managers would have done the same, especially with the pressures that are on Michael in terms of progression in this tournament? Uh, <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I think a, a club at this, I, I, I think I'd have done it, if I'm being true, honest. Um, it'd been interesting to see what would have happened if we'd have won 3 2, but he made a decision and I think it was the right one, and, uh, you know, I think sometimes a bit of class is going out of football, I'm afraid. And I think that showed up. Okay. Right. Cheers, guys. Thanks. Bye. Cheers.